Good day and welcome to Daily News on Remo TV. I'm Olama Dike. The President Muhammad Buhari on Wednesday led all the members of the Federal Executive Council to observe a minute silence in honor of the late father of the choir state, Abdulganayu Abdul Razak, who died last week. The paid your respect to the deceased at the commencement of the council's virtual meeting, being presided over by the president. The Open State Government has directed the task force in the state to lock down shops and markets where COVID-19 guidelines are flagrantly disobeyed. The special advisor to Governor Dapo Abiodun on public communications, Honorable Remy Hazan, who spoke with Tribune Online on Tuesday, said that the state COVID-19 task force, headed by the Deputy Governor Engineer Noimo Salako Oyedele, has also intensified efforts to ensure compliance with the guidelines is enhanced. The development is coming on the heels of a report by Saturday Tribune, which chronicled the defiance to the use of face masks, social distancing, and regular hand washing across open states. On the international scene, U.S. Treasury Secretary Steve Nochen said on Wednesday that TikTok was under a national security review and that his agency will make a recommendation to the president about the popular Chinese-owned video sharing app this week. The comments marked the first time the U.S. government has acknowledged that TikTok was under review by a Committee on Foreign Investment in the United States, which scrutinizes deals by foreign acquirers for potential national security risk and is led by Treasury. On sports, Xavi Hernandez, who is coaching Al Zad in Qatar, says his primary goal is to coach Barcelona while he won a host of trophies, but he is focused on his current job. Xavi also said he was fine after testing positive for COVID-19. I do not hide and I have always said that my primary goal when it happens is Baka. It is my home and I will be a dream, said Xavi in an interview published on Tuesday in the Madrid Sports newspaper, Maka. On entertainment, actress Shola Shobawali, popularly known as Toyin Tomato, in an interview has revealed how she has remained fit in the industry. Celebrity Alva tells more about her lifestyle relating to factors behind her present physical fitness as well as active performance in her movie career. Describing herself during the interview, she said, I am Shola Shobowali, an actress, influencer, ambassador, a mother, homemaker, and I have a down-to-earth person. I'm a proud African with lovely children. Also answering another question being in the Nollywood industry for decades and still on top of your game, how she has been able to achieve it. It's not by power but by the grace of God and nothing can be done without him. Secondly, it is hard work and you know it pays. You have to believe in yourself, be very focused and ready to learn and be corrected. Have the desire to conquer whatever challenges that come your way and finally be ready to carry everybody along as a team player. That will be all for daily news. Join us tomorrow for more stories. Don't forget to follow us on all our social media platforms at Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Don't also forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel at Official Remo TV. You can also visit our website at www.remotv.com.ng. I'm Olamadike. Bye for now.